Endocrinology is the science of hormones, which are substances secreted from the glands into the bloodstream, which actually go to every single organ and tissue of the body, ensuring proper function. A hormone deficiency or a hormone excess should be treated by an endocrinologist, a hormone specialist, the same way a heart problem should be treated by a cardiologist or a heart specialist. The endocrine system or the hormone empire is highly regulated and is the most sophisticated computer imaginable. The system changes in a fraction of seconds and is truly the most fascinating system in the body. It will be responsible for our birth and our death, for going through puberty, for giving the signal of starting your first period as a woman or having erections as a man. It is responsible for the flight or fight response, for being able to be in an upright position. It will regulate our hunger, thirst, satiety, sexual instinct, and so on. There is a queen mother gland or the commander in chief called the pituitary gland, which controls your thyroid, your adrenals, your sexual hormones, and so on. It is a very small gland, the size of a pea, in charge of half of the hormones in the human body, and its efficiency is humbling to any computer to date. Well, some of the most common diseases are osteoporosis, affecting one in two women and one in four men. Thyroid disease, which affects one in four people, either high or low thyroid, Graves' disease or thyroid cancer. Diabetes, which affects one in uh, five people. High cholesterol, one in three people. Low testosterone in men is one in four people. And then adrenal failure and pituitary failure following at uh, a much lower of one or two percent. Endocrinology is highly scientific and combines traditional clinical evaluation of the patient with the detective work of an experienced endocrinologist. It is extremely important to follow the science of hormone replacement or hormone suppression according to evidence-based medicine and treat only if there is a hormonal imbalance since addition of hormones just to make somebody feel better or lose weight can trigger serious and dangerous complications.